It's from one of our most favorite weed companies. Y'all know I'm lots of y'all. It's from Sam's Beauty. And Sam's Beauty is one of my most favorite companies because they were one of the first companies to rock with me. I was actually buying from Sam's Beauty way before I even got on YouTube. So I love them. If you look in the description box, I put a direct link to this wig and all their little social medias. All right, let's talk about the wig. Now, this wig is part of a collection that y'all, I must be honest. I, well, first, let me silk some wrong. <laughs> the election results came out. <laughs> This wig is part of a collection that y'all I had a love-hate relationship with. And that's that butter collection by Sensational. Some of the wigs straight butter. I mean Lando Lakes, just smooth, gliding. Like your feet after a fresh pedicure. Some of the wigs in that collection, margarine. Rough. Your feet in like January. Because you don't believe in getting pedicures when everybody going to see your feet. Okay, but for the most part, I will say I have really enjoyed those wigs, especially Butter 7, Butter 8. Yeah, it's a few of them I really, really love, okay? So, Sam's Beauty was nice enough to send us over another one. This Butter 6, okay? Like I said, I love 7 and 8, so let's look, hope we love 6, okay? They sent it in this beautiful color, Flamboyage Mocha, and that's no secret. Y'all know that's one of my favorite colors. I actually prefer... Uh, prefer uh, is it caramel or something in that collection too? But they sent it in mocha. It comes with wider part and inner ear lace. It is heat safe from 350 to 400 degrees. Um, what else? It's now, it say undetectable lace, but that it ain't been undetectable for me. Y'all, I've always had to go through and cut off like a whole bunch of that lace for me for them to work. We gonna see. All right, so there she is and she comes in tons of colors, okay? We don't care about the stock card. Let's just look directly at the wig, okay? Like I said, came with lace. I already cut it off. Y'all, look at this color, okay? And like I said, I got flamboyage mocha. So it's these pretty chocolate tones, and you got some lighter pieces right there in the front, okay? Cute. That's going to be real cute for fall. Like, these tones uh, almost remind me a little bit of a darker version of hot Choco and Valentino. So cute. Let's look at the construction. Comb in the back, adjustable straps, y'all. My silly self so excited about the malicious results. I can't stop thinking about it. Okay? You got a comb here to the right, a comb to the left. There's that ear-to-ear -ear lace, and there's your parting space that is lace as well. Okay, ain't nothing to it but to do it. Let's put on the stocking cap. <laughs> y'all are so excited about the wig and the doggone election results, but you know. I'm going to try not to even talk about politics because I feel like you might, somebody in them comments might get a little reckless. And I will. <laughs> okay. So, wait, yeah, okay. Let me brush her out a little bit because, you know, she was sitting over there in my net, but the results came out. I started hopping around. Now, I want you to see that I didn't, I didn't cut off all the lace because them baby hair, hairs are there. And I'm pretty sure I am, but I just want y'all to see it before I do that. And after I do that, I think that this color is going to be really beautiful for the fall. Yeah, that's going to be nice. Um, As far as how she fits on my head, people always say, is she big head friendly? Hell, I don't know if I got a big head or not, but uh, this one fitting a little snug. Okay. That's the lace with me doing nothing to it. You kind of see, you kind of see it there. If I wore this out, y'all, I would cut that out because I don't wear baby hairs. Okay, but that really does not look bad. Hold on, let me be honest. Let me turn off this ring light real quick. There you are. See, there's a better representation of it. What I'm gonna do is cut that out, y'all.
first piece. And there's a better representation of that color too. Ooh, y'all, this is cute. Let me stand up so y'all can get a full view. I am 5'5", five, five, and that's where she falls on me. Remember, I no longer have my light locked on me, so that's why you see it bouncing around. Y'all, this color is gorgeous, okay? This is number six, straight on. This is her to the left. This is her to the right. And this is her to the back. Once again, that's where she falls. Y'all, this is gorgeous. Okay, I was thinking that I wasn't gonna like this color because I didn't see the lighter pieces, but like straight on like this, I definitely can. Let me put a little bit of powder in that part. Like I said, if I wore this out, y'all, I would cut that lace out. Matter of fact, I am. See, it, I mean, it doesn't even look bad without that uh, anything added to it. All right, so y'all, I'm gonna take this off and cut that little bit of lace out. So that's how it looks now, remember that. Y'all know I just like to be completely honest. I don't want nobody lying uh, or coming on here. You lied. The lit girl, shut up. Don't be no lie. Don't spread fake news. I'm making this video run over. Let me cut these hairs out and shut up talking to y'all. All right, so y'all, I literally, on all these butter units, cut all that lace out. Look, look at that baby head on fell victim. Ain't nothing about me, baby. I always say that, so I don't wear baby hairs. And when I do that, that makes the world of difference on these butter units. To See how much better that looks to me? Look, cut that doggone lace off. Let me pull that off my forehead. That wig was on my eyebrows, okay? With that lace cut off, I think that this wig is absolutely gorgeous. I think this wig is extremely beginner friendly. You see, all I did was run a little bit of powder up that part. Let's see if it can be shifted because I know one of y'all going to ask. Mm. I got a little bit of humpage and y'all know I'm bald there, but if you run your flat iron over, that should fix it. Yeah, it can be shifted. That's her to the right. And then can you shift her over here to the left? Actually, I like her to the left way better than to the right. And I'm not a left part wear. Okay, so yes, do I recommend this wig? Yes, look in that description box. I'll put a direct link to where you can go get Butter Six from my good booze over there at Sam's Beauty. Okay, yeah, that's one about. Like I always say, maybe you're not <laughs> into wigs. Maybe it's your Auntie Kamala. She's so bomb. Maybe it's your Uncle Donald. He a little upset. I don't know why he might be. Maybe he just need a good wig in his life. Send them my way. Me and Sam you didn't get them right, y'all. I was looking for my little clipper. Yeah, mm-hmm. Love it. Until next time, which will be very doggone soon.